are in the Big Bend National Park Fossil Discovery Exhibit. Big Bend has been many things in addition yeah. to a desert. And for much of the history of Big Bend, over 100 million years ago, it was ocean. As things changed and began drying, we had more swampy marsh areas, okay. and a whole new group of creatures came in. Wow. Big Bend was home to one of the most terrifying creatures I could ever imagine, which yes. is about a 40-foot long crocodile. This Dinosuchus rio grandensis that basically fed on dinosaurs. Geology here is just perfect to have preserved fossils and now we are just on the scene now as humans, just the right time in history when they're now being uncovered by erosion. So just Big Bend is kind of like a treasure chest of fossils. Right, yeah. such an incredibly unique area. It really is. So I've been here since, yeah. we've, uh, oh. since we opened in 2018, yeah. and uh, ever since then, I've been smoking meat, and she's been brewing her beer. So tell me what got you into brewing? Uh, just being a fermentation enthusiast. So what you've got there is the Cunado Mexican Lager. Okay. Uh, we made yeah. that to celebrate the graduation of our kitchen manager here, Andrew, because we have such a small system and we're so like connected with the community that I like to highlight and shout out for people to make beers and celebrate. Right. So. Phil, I mean, there's a lot of barbecue on this table. Yes, ma'am. How do you do it? You wake up early. Wake up early? <laughs> really, you gotta wake up like, early. Don't ever sleep. He's, yeah. he's in that 3 a.m. club. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, so we uh, we start our, our cooking at 3 a.m., 3 a.m., 3.30, depending on how early we wake up that day. Okay. But yeah, <clears throat> we generally usually, usually do our briskets anywhere from 12 to 14 hours. Okay. Um, the other proteins that you see, they don't take as long. Okay. Uh, but we generally like to start our fires pretty early. This is a controversial opinion, but this is the best part of Texas right here. Yeah. <laughs> Take a look at this room. It's a Puebla style going on here, a little bit southwestern feel. Beautiful exposed wooden beams. Got a little bit of a cowboy theme with some chaps up there. Another great day here in the Big Bend. I'm actually ending it at the White Buffalo Bar with a little dinner and a little ranch water, which legend has it actually originated at the Gage Hotel. Not y'all. Welcome to the Gage Gardens. Thank you. It's breathtaking. I think you already know that, though. <laughs> well, it's always good to hear. Yes. So tell me Thanks. a little bit about the Gage Gardens. Um, well, this has been under development for about 25 years, slowly expanding. Okay. Um, it started off as a simple vegetable garden. Really? And moved on <laughs> from there. My time here in the Big Bend has been absolutely amazing. The food has been delicious, the adventures have been exhilarating. It's definitely a drive, but it's definitely worth the trip. To find out where we're going next, make sure to visit us on social media or check out our website. See y'all later.